This is a partner yoga sequence. You can use it to practice yoga with a friend, with your husband, with your brother, or your, with your co-athlete. We begin in a seated position with crossed legs. We trust a partner relaxing our back on his back. And we feel his breath on our back muscles. And then we both extend the hands up to the sky by inhaling, lengthening the whole spine up. And we bend to the side by the inhalation. Choose one side and bend. Inhale back to the center and rise up through the fingertips. Extend the whole spine and bend to the other side, exhaling. Back to the center, inhale up. Exhale and give a nice stretch to your partner. Pull him on your back. Now Maria takes the benefits of the stretch, opening the torso up to the sky. And now we change because Maria can do this for Spiros too. So she will pull Spiros up and Spiros will open and widen his chest. And then back to a seated position and let's have some fun now. We will hug the elbows of our partner. We press firmly both feet down and by pressing our backs together, we will try to lift the whole body up. So one, two, three, let's give it a try. And they made it. Great job. <laughs> now cross the fingers together and make a big step to the front side. And now we press the pelvis forward to open the chest as much as possible, as if we try to make a narrow and look up to the sky. You see the Maria's version, the bendy one, and the athlete's version, because, of course, they have different, different bodies. And let's go back to the center again. Make one step back. And again, one step forward to make the twist. And now catch the right hand of Maria and open to stretch again forward. Let's try to change sides without changing the base. Extend. Very good. And back to the center. And now we make a step back. We keep our backs together again. And slowly we start to bend forward and fold above our thighs. Keep your partner's hands. It's going to help you to move down. And now you can catch the shins of your friend and make this forward fold even deeper. Now we walk with both our palms to the front side of the mat and find a straight plank. Bring your feet together, keep your ankles together, find a strong line from the top of your head to your heels. Now bend knees, chest and chin on your mats, knees, chest and chin. And roll forward to the cobra pose by inhaling. Rise up to the downward facing dog, exhaling. We will bring the right leg forward and we will drop the left knee down. Inhale and rise up with the hands, look above your head. Exhale, both palms down and downward facing dog. Let's do it to the other side too. Left leg forward, right knee down. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, back to the downward facing dog. And let's give a twist. Again, right leg to the front side and left knee down. This time we push the hands up to the sky by inhaling and we twist to the right when we exhale. Twist to the right and bring your right hand to Maria's hand. And now Maria will pull Spiros forward. Spiros will pull Maria forward. Good. Inhale both hands up to the sky again. Exhale both palms down and back to the downward facing dog to twist to the other side. Left leg forward, right knee down. Inhale and rise up through the fingertips. Exhale and twist to the left. Inhale, hands up, exhale and release to the downward facing dog. Very nice. 
and now walk with your feet to your palms and slowly come all the way up to the standing pose inhale all the way up exhale and twist to look at your friend and now let's make it closer we will bring the palms on our friend's shoulder and we need the distance yes so that we can press the chest down. You can either bend the knees or not. The important part of the exercise is the spine. Very nice. And now you can drop the hands down on your mats for a downward facing dog with the palms together at the centers of the mats. Yeah, that's it. Now we bring the right leg forward make sure your feet stay together the one close to the other press the left heel down and rise up to warrior two pose opening the, hand, the hands to the sides speedos press the heel down please this one very good and now speedos pulls maria and maria pulls speedos away and now we will try to extend the front leg and both athletes bring the hands down on the mats to the triangle pose and lift the wrist. <laughs> left hand up, left hand up. If you cannot fully extend the right leg, you can choose Speedo's version or you can fully extend the right leg as Maria does. Bend the right knee again, inhale back to the warrior two pose, inhaling. And let's open back to reverse warrior exhaling. This will give you a nice stretch to the right ribs. Inhale all the way back with the palms on your mat. Exhale to the downward facing dog. Let's do it with the left leg too. Left leg comes forward. Keep your feet as close as possible. Press the right heel down. Rise up through the right hand to warrior two pose. And catch your friend's hand. And try to pull, to pull him away from the center. Very nice. Extend the left leg, inhaling. Exhale and release the left hand down on your mats. The right hand down, up to the sky. Try to look inside your right palm. Either extended knees or softly bended in spiros. Open your pelvis to the right. Bend the left knee again and come up to the warrior two, inhaling. Exhale, reverse warrior. Open the left ribs up to the sky. Stay as low as possible with the left thigh. Inhale all the way back on your mat. Exhale, downward facing dog. You can leave your knees down on your mat and relax to the child's pose. But make sure you catch your friend's palms. Let's stay connected. Good. 